that would be like fiction. You were founded in 1975. You don't look that old. No, ha ha. I am not. Uh -huh. And tell me about the, what, what you do and what your publications are about. Right, right. So, the Lesbian History Archives is the world's oldest and largest collection of materials by and about lesbians. Represents a diverse lesbian experience. And it's located in Park Slope, Brooklyn. Uh, and is it is it unique? I mean, is lesbian materials generally neglected by most centers that gather material on so-called homosexual community? I think the Lesbian History Archives is unique in that it was the first lesbian archives founded institutionally, right, unto itself in the 70s, and it came out of a need for a place for a repository for lesbian materials that that were out there, you know, and because how, the need was for a space, like and, for a gathering place. And, and how, how did it uh, meld with, like, the feminist movement of the day? I know you had a Bella Abzug. She had a lesbian daughter, but she herself wasn't. Battling Bella was heterosexual. I so, mean, how did it meld with the feminist movement? Were you? Well, right there, are a lot of is there people who use still? the archives. Or is it now much better? It's much better now, right? Better in terms of that the feminists do not. They used to be so afraid people would call them a lesbian. They had to have the pink. Right, 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 demo. right, right. Yeah, I mean. That's less so the case now, right? There's right. definitely space carved out for proper lesbians. And, and, and you have a lot of researchers come to you now? We have a lot material. of researchers come around, yep, yep, yep. And, you know, we've all got all different kinds of materials, buttons, videos, special collections, which are collections And where will it all go when the founders die? Do you know if they've made it? Well, it will be carried on by lesbians forever. It will be. Yep. Oh, so it's incorporated and it has a financial and a, a volunteer base that'll keep it going? It's in, So it's incorporated. It's a non-profit Yeah. But so there's always a I mean, you wonder if you make a backup with the New York Times in case, I mean, New York Public Library, just in case, you know, like the gay, gay archives out in California ended up in the UCLA. Really? Library. Yeah, because that's Yeah, no, we right. are, we'll, we will never be a part of an institution besides the archives because the archives are supposed to be accessible to all lesbians, right? No matter their income, their education. Yeah, many, experience. many archives. I knew NYU archives are impossible to get into. Right? They don't yeah. have stuff cataloged and you can't go and get a lot of stuff there. Right. Okay, well, and people can find you where? In Park Slope, Brooklyn. And on the internet, do you have? Yep, Lesbian Story Archives. Lesbian. Her Story Archives. Uh,